What's going on guys? This is that one leaper here and I'm back again with another Pokemon Tournament ranked video. Let's get right into it. Suicune, Eveltal, Latios, support set. Once it loads up, of course. Bam, here we go. And I have been gone for a few days, but I'm now I'm back. I was on a little vacation trip, but now I am returned. So let's get right into it. I'm really excited. I'm really excited to make more content. But let's get right into it. Let's see. Oh, my champ. My champ. So Suicune obviously beats Machamp like big time because of projectiles. You can keep Machamp out if you're really good at it. But of course if Machamp gets in on Suicune, let's just go into the next round because if Machamp gets in on Suicune, it, I think it's person personally I think it's over if Machamp gets in on Suicune. Uh, so a little bit of lag in this match, but okay, he got it in on me. Uh, he shielded. I know he's been doing that a lot, just walking up and grab shielding, so I'll just go up, go up, run up and grab. Alright, that was dumb of me, I just charged in. Okay, I held counter for way too long. I should have released it as soon as he hit me, but I didn't. Alright. Oh, he hit me with the aerial grab. That's something that I don't see many chance to do. Alright, he went in for the grab. I'm using a lot of moves that I'm I don't I don't use. And that should be it. Oh, I should have attacked there because that's actually not a true combo, I've learned. I should have attacked there, I messed up. But yeah, as you can see, if Machan gets in on Suicune, it's over. So if I don't keep him out, that's the end of the game, really. Because Suicune isn't that really he isn't really very good at um close combat. And now that you see the Machamp, he's just uh Alright, what I did there was walk back a little bit because I had a feeling he was gonna go for a grab. Alright, there we go for the uh anti -air. All right, that time he let go of shield, not a smart option, and I'll get this combo here, which causes the field phase and gives me a bit, a bit of synergy to work with. If you don't know, and if you don't play this game, synergy is, is, the, is the bar that you use to um, go into burst mode. All right, there he goes into burst mode himself. All right. Whoa. Alright, now I go into burst mode myself to disrupt whatever he was going to do. Alright, now I call him Eveltal. She has some shield pressure in. And I'm going to Hydro Pump as well. Hoping for the Guard Break. Double Hydro Pump. If he shielded that, he, I would have gotten the Guard Break. And it, since he didn't have, he had no choice there. Nice little trap for me. But now I'll have no synergy for round 3. That rhymed. Awesome. Alright, here I go. Alright, this one challenge is definitely not bad. You definitely don't want to challenge that move. Um, especially when fully charged, so you can uh... What? I did not counter. I swear to you guys, I attacked. That's fine. Okay, that's that. I think that might be the game. Oh nope, it's not the game yet. All right, whatever he does here, I'm hoping my Voltal will be able to. Do. All right, not able to. That's maybe the KO. Oh, good games to him. Good player indeed. I still have a lot to learn about this game, clearly. But yeah, good games. Lost wow, 56 points there. Let's see if we can get that back. Oh man. Alright, here I am back again. Um, new challenger. Let's see who we get this time. Hopefully, it'll be not a Machamp. Yes, it breaks some different character. There was a time I went on ranked and I just got the same guy five times in a row. So, I, hopefully, Nintendo fixed that with the patch. <gasps> there was a patch. And. 
now a bunch of things changed but I have I'm not sure I know Sui Queen wasn't changed at all I know sh um, Shadow Mewtwo um, Infinite eliminated Infinite's no longer in the game Breaks in got either buffed or nerfed I don't know I heard she got changed Mewtwo got um, nerfed um, what else happened um, a lot of things happened and that was dumb by me that was really dumb by me alright stop okay good job by this breaks in um, conditioning me to think she was going to shoot projectiles then flying in getting that free attack that is a true combo by the way Interesting. All right, this breaks it. I have to be more aware of when she uses projectiles. That way, I can mirror code it, negating the effect completely. Oh, nice. All right, nice attacking. He knew I was gonna grab after that jump, that jump over. All right. Oh, that's it. I mirror coded that. I could have sworn. That's a KO. Definitely shouldn't have challenged that aerial attack. As soon as I saw it, I shouldn't have challenged it. I should have just shielded. Because if you didn't know, if you charge in with your standard attack while in field phase, you can actually shield to stop as I'll demonstrate right now. As we can see. Alright, he tried to grab. Attacks. Alright, um... Two um, projectiles that rely heavily on um, two projectiles. Two characters that rely heavily on projectiles. All right, I'm gonna start using a little bit more anti -airs. No, you're funny. All right, anti air. There we go. You don't see who's jumping a lot. Don't use that enough, even though it's a really good move. Alright, next time he uses that, I'm definitely gonna punish. And I didn't punish! Interesting. Alright, I'm gonna use Yveltal. Hopefully, it'll negate anything that he does here. Just like it did in the last Machamp match. No, he flies away. Smart. Just trying to make sure I don't get hit by any of this stuff. I grabbed, but the, the, the command didn't come out for it. Uh oh, that's not good. I'm gonna get hit by that. That's the game. That's the game, right? Yep, that's the game. That was my mistake totally. I should not have challenged it. I, sh I should have waited it. He was about to get out of burst, but I was stupid and patient, and I ended up getting punished for it. That was a huge screw up by me. Hopefully, it won't, I won't do that again. Alright, moving right along to the next match. I'll see you guys when I find another person. Alright, I'm back again and a new challenger. Let's see who we get this time. Um, a Charizard. Alright, two straight losses. I'm hoping to get a win here. Maybe get a couple more. Hopefully. <laughs> I'm playing awful bad today. Or maybe the people I'm playing are just that good. Probably both. You never know. Alright, we're gonna start with Latios. I haven't used Latios at all during this whole video, I don't think. But here we go. Charizard, I don't know a lot about this character. What I do know is that he's very strong and you do not want to challenge anything that he throws out. Like, close range wise. Alright. That's gonna come to face shift. Alright. Saw the blue countered with the green because that's how this game works <laughs> it's a huge game of rock paper all right anti-air there we go aurora beam he uses Cresselia. i'm gonna get that um regenerate hp heal double um aurora beam that was that air wise using the same move Alright, go into burst. Whoa! That's an anti-air. 
Oh no, that's not good. I'm gonna get hit by that. Oh no, 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 no. no. I might actually die from this, because Charizard's burst attack is insanely strong. Is that it? No, I'm still alive. Yes, thank you. Alright, rope through the counter. Alright, broke through the fire punch with grab. I think that was a fire punch, I'm not sure. But that ends up in my win, in my favor, and I have burst mode, which is a lot of pluses at once. Alright, so what I see from this guy, he does the same thing in neutral, just do it all well. So I gotta punish that with Miracoat. Alright, this is aerial attack that since he doesn't know how to throw out anti -A's. Alright, let's see what he's going to do. Alright, I'm just going to throw that out. I'm going to use Pretalia for that regenerate HP, and he's going to get about 40 HP healed. Gotta stay as far away. Oh, he just goes on and does, does it. Oh, and I get hit by it? I thought I shielded, but you know. Inputs. I'm going to get hit by that, take about 300 damage, you know, half my health bar, no big deal. <laughs> Alright, it's important you do not challenge anything that Charizard fills out, especially when he's in burst mode. Alright. This might not even do anything, I think he did a move before I did something. Uh, I, actually. There we go. Alright, now I'm gonna go burst mode to disturb whatever he was gonna do. Oh, he grabbed my burst attack, and Suicune's burst attack, if you didn't know, is actually- Whoa! 200 damage?! That is absolutely crazy! That's gonna be the end of the game. Mirror coded those fireballs. Just spam fireballs three straight times. And I um I punished it the third time. But that's insane. He got 200 damage off of a grab and 300 off of the burst attack. He took out almost all of my health with just two moves, which is absolutely insane. Shows how good and over and powerful Charizard is. But as long as he doesn't get close and you don't get hit by him, not really much of a threat. If you know what you're doing. Which obviously I don't. Anyway, new challenger. Let's see who this will be. Lucario. Alright, cool. 572 battles. Yeah, that's uh, two times as many as I've played. Fantastic. Hopefully this guy will just beat me terribly, that way I learn a lot. That's how fighting is works, if you didn't know. The more you get beat, the better you get. No, I chose the top by accident, I wanted to choose Latios. Whatever. I should probably start experimenting with more support sets. Because I never know... What's this guy doing? What's this guy's plan? Alright. Alright, okay, he punished the... Uh, he knew I was going to charge up the last one. Cause... Oh, interesting. He just counters out of that because he knew I was going to. Wow, okay, this guy's exceptional. He's reading me like a really good book. But I do get that. Alright, I counter there because I had a feeling he was going to. Alright, grab right out of that because I had a feeling he was going to shield. And now this is looking to be pretty even. Grab the counter, there we go. And now this is starting to look in my favor after that a bit of a slow start. Interesting. And that's gonna be the end of round one. He tried to follow up from the field phase. Sadly, you can't follow up anything off from a field phase unless you get a super hard move. Read, read, read. Alright, round two. Just gonna do a bit of circles. Interesting. Alright, that's the uh, Empire. Alright, counter. Counter um, combos into that. And I'm gonna get some damage here. Here we go. Alright, there we go. I made him think I was going to go in for the grab, but instead I ended up going in for a counter. Now he's going to go into burst mode, because honestly who wouldn't bother that pressure? 
I'm gonna call on Evelto, see what happens. He's either gonna A, block, or B, just two attack. Alright, he blocked, good job. Alright, now I'm gonna go into burst mode. That's gonna heal 80 HP, which is absolutely insane. He's gonna, probably gonna block here. No! He did not block, so that's gonna be the game. Good games. Wow, that was intense. This guy is not bad at all. I just happened to play out of my mind and get insane reads. But good games to that guy. Whew. And that's how I'm gonna close out the video today, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys enjoy my videos and want to see more, be sure to hit that subscribe and like button. And if you don't, go ahead and hit that dislike and comment down below what I can improve on. Until next time, this is That One Libra signing off.